just getting back from the muffler shop. I got the um the black Tomei style mufflers put on my girl's car. Cause I had the straight pipes with just, just no muffler, just straight pipe. It had like tips on there, but it wasn't no muffler on there. And that thing was loud as a motherfucker. So I liked it, but it was too too loud, like all the time. Like I would do that if I had like the muffler where you could cut it on and cut it off. Like it's a valve down there, I guess. I don't know how it works. You, I guess you press a button, the valve closes, the valve opens. But if I had something like that, then I would do that. But th that was too loud. Like any if I'm riding like 11, 12, 1, 2, 3 o'clock in the morning through a neighborhood, like, bro, I'm trying to creep. You feel me? Like that shit's like, what? Tut, 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 tut. At night time, man, like that shit's too loud in the morning. So, you know, I got the I got the um the tome style with the silencer, but I took the silencer out and it's still it's still decent. It's not as loud as the as the with the straight pipe, but I'm I'm cool with it. I'll let y'all hear it right quick. Let me see what I'm window down. Let y'all hear that joke. Feel me? Still doing something. You know what I'm saying? Still making noise. But it ain't crackling. You feel me? Like that thing was like obnoxious. But yeah, man, um Y'all can go back in the videos and check out and see what kind of what the muffler actually looked like. Go on my uploads. It's a HK5. Muffler off eBay. I think we paid like $32. Shout out to my mom. My mom bought them for me. I ain't gonna sit down and lie. You know what I'm saying? She looked out. She caught them for me. But, um, uh, appreciate you. But, um, I just not getting them put on because I've been working. I've been working every day. And, um, the muffler shop is that I like to go to, that I'm gonna start going to. Um, I don't even have the name of it. What's the name of this joint, man? I had the receipt in here somewhere. I think I might have thrown it away. I'm trying to find it. I would like to shout them out. Oh, I found it. Let's see if the name is on this paper. Okay, shout out to Discount Radiator and Mufflers on 807 San Mateo Boulevard, Southeast Albuquerque. Shout out to them boys, man. They charged me two ninety six. But y'all were like, mm, "This is a little steep." I got the the resonator taken out, and I got two tips put on for two hundred ninety six dollars. I went to Midas on Manal in Louisiana. And they tried to charge me eleven eighty six. That's eleven hundred eighty six dollars. Yeah, go go to go on their reviews, and I post the receipt that they they charged me. They charged me $999 for labor. So shout out to these people right here for saving me this $800. You feel me? So I'm not even mad. Even though he didn't give me no new pipe in the back, he just bent it or made it fit. But he did, they did a good job nevertheless. It's working, and he fixed my rattle. It was a rattle. I was going to get some foam and spray inside because the pipe they put in before was too... Small that fit in the hole, so when it when it when it when it's on, it be rattling. So I was gonna spray that foam out. It take heat like a firewall and spray paint it black. But I don't think I do that. They hooked me up with that, so they they did a good job, man. Shout out to them people, man. Not even had the price. That's triple times lower, quadruple. You feel me? So shout out to them people, man. Discount radiator and mufflers on 807 San Mateo Boulevard, Southeast. But other than that, <clears throat> I got the alternator coming. That should be here Thursday. You got to put the control arms on my girl's car. My transmission came in. And I done rolled up to the shop twice to see if my car moved. They ain't start working on it yet. So hopefully they can get the crack of this weekend. If not, sometime next week. But we, we making slow progress moving forward with these new size of I've been running across a lot of problems since I had these cars, but 
the thing is, these are all fixable problems. Like, it, it, no problem I ran into was hard to fix. Like, it was all easy. It's just that I didn't know what I was doing. But once you learn your car, which I probably would never sell this car, these two cars, I probably always keep them because I can always fix them. So that's what I like about them. These are my, my project cars, my two project cars, my girl's project car, and I got my project car. <clears throat> so that's what I'm working with right now. I'm eventually going to get something else, but I don't know. And I ain't worried about it right now. I'm just trying to get both of these cars running right now. And then I worry about that. But other than that, man, that's what's going on right now. I come up with another video when I get when I get my car out the shop running. <laughs> I got to put a whole new stereo system in that. Radio, speakers, amp, run the wires. Well, I ran the, the wires already ran for that, for the Miz amp. But got to get the windshield fixed. All kind of stuff, man. But... Yeah, y'all just keep 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 tuning in, man. Show they appreciate that love y'all show and appreciate the comments, man. The 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 good and the bad. I'm not even tripping because you know I don't know y'all. Y'all definitely don't know me, so. And I, I get majority good comments anyway. Maybe some kind some sometimes it be some bogus, uh, comment or two. But I appreciate it all, man. I love y'all right where y'all at, man. So we'll see y'all have a good day and take it easy.